she was just walking down the street singing do a diddy diddy dum diddy dum. <laughs> Hi, sexy faces. We're out here doing another virtual chore. It's about time. I'm in need of some art, and so are you. So hit up that Derek Eller Gallery on Bloomer Street. Definitely going to have the address down below. Check out the beauties in here, though, you guys. You guys are going to love it. Our first artist is Amber Robles, an Afro-Latina artist from Puerto Rico, raised in Atlanta. Love her work. It's based on collage magazine cutouts as well as like um different substrates a lot of embellishments really dope work especially the context behind it she talks about eugenics and about sterilizing women in puerto rico as well as um some of the religions that are out there um some of her videos on youtube go in depth about some of these pieces but i just wanted to show you guys how amazing it looks in person Sorry about the glare, you will see me, but, um, yeah. Hola. <laughs> but, you guys, this is a really dope, um, gallery. They don't really harass you, um, about anything as long as you just have your mask on. Um, I came in kind of early, so there was really nobody there, so I'm excited about that. But look at this. Look at all the details in this work. Look at all the embellishments. I believe this, um, that one is about the sterilization. This is about um, one of the bays in Puerto Rico where um, the water, because um, sheesh, my mom told me the story last night. But there's something in the water that makes it glow at night. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, do your research because um, I have not done mine, <laughs> apparently. Um, yeah, really cool work. This is her. Look up Amber Robles. Gordon, and you will um find a bunch of her art. Like I said, a lot of it is um collage work. A lot of it is um like sand, the Andre hand sewn pieces, bead work and stuff. Amazing art though. So you guys have to check her out. She's an Atlanta based artist now. This Stranger Yellow um exhibit by Miss Moon Hunty, because I don't want to butcher your first name. I am in love. Like, oh my God, the ceramics. The yellow, like, this banana yellow. Okay, you guys, I bet that because look at this. I've never seen this before. I've never seen ceramics on a canvas. Um, I'm amazed. You see this beautiful face behind that? Stranger face. Like, I I'm in love with it. I'm in love with this yellow, sincerely. And the banana peels, like, honey, how'd you get it on there? I read that it was resin, but, um, How? Tell me, Miss Moon. Sheesh. Do you guys see this? It's the yellow for me. Like, <laughs> oh my God. Wait, you guys are going to gag because um, I didn't want to leave this exhibit. I'm so in love. Japanese artist. Um, amazing work. Look at this. Goodness. No, you have to, like, experience it in person if you can. But, um, check out the movement. Oh, man, I love it. And as far as, like, her incorporating, incorporating, um, fortune cookies in this artwork, um, she incorporates peaches that look like boobies. Adorable. You guys are gonna see, um, a lot of eyes, mouths. Um, she incorporates a lot of, like, Japanese art as well as like Mexican art beautiful beautiful work like yes baby take this in because if you see the detail like she put the whole great wall in that bit look at this do you see it though I mean come on <sighs> yeah it's the yellow like I cannot give this painting any justice at all. And the blue, wait till you guys see this other piece in the corner, like, okay, I'm just gonna shut up and let you enjoy this a little bit. Okay, now no, you guys, bust the tea up. Do you guys see this? Oh, this lamp, I am in love. Like I need, I need to make money. I need to really make some good, good money because this is ridiculous. Like, I want to buy it. It's just too expensive. 
but she's a beauty oh my god you see I was all up on it like um I'm trying to see and the glazes that she uses like dandy shandy <laughs> it don't make any sense honey beautiful beautiful work but like I said no justice to being there wait till you see the ceramic pieces like the vases like I was gagging okay look at this beautiful piece come on now you guys that green that spirit pond though baby come on and she threw in some of that yellow <sighs> come on yeah share the love because we need more love sincerely spread the love this year you have a new chance to start over peep the eyes on the fortune cookies and the lily like the water lily come on this is so sexy let's go with the lotus like what baby <laughs> and there goes that banana yellow come on it's the talent Man, this is so cool to like really get out and check out some art because, um, yeah, okay. Now, this blue, you guys, come on, do you see this blue? This yellow wave blue, though, I don't know. She needs to, first of all, she needs to trademark that yellow. <laughs> don't ever, ever share the maker of this yellow, it's just so beautiful. Yeah, you guys, now, come on, walk with me. This is bananas, it's hung. All right, so the braids in it is actually synthetic hair. This is, I think, earthworm, um, come, yeah, earthworm ceramics, I guess, with glaze. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't know, you guys. She used a little bit of everything because this don't make no sense. Do you see the mom heart? Do you see this? Do you see the glazing? Do you know how hard that is? Those colors? Hmm. I see like the Mexican inspired like, oh. and there goes that sexy yellow with the snake though. I see you baby. Okay. Be aware of snakes in the yard, honey. Okay. They are out there. Hate that dragon. Mm-mm. All right, I'll shut up and let you enjoy a little bit of this. you guys these are like so beautiful so inspiring check this baby out what peach toad but it looks like a dumpling it looks like a titty and it's oozing so i'm not sure but oh, man <laughs> and the black and white with the scales i get out there with the synthetic hair braiding like honey Man, I hope you guys are enjoying this. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, and all that good stuff. Tell a friend to tell a friend to tell a friend. I see you movement. Yeah. Like, come on. Who else is giving you virtual tours in these art galleries like this, though? Like, ain't nobody getting up close like this. I'm crossing boundaries for you, baby. No. <laughs> Nah, but for real though, you already know. Look at this. Come on. <laughs> All you can do is laugh. Like, what? Who taught you? Who taught you this? Look at those eyes. I'm a sucker for some eyes, baby. Now, look at that with the jug pouring into it. We're going to get close though. 
Yes, baby, show them the smile, like, with that yellow. And those little peaches with the babies, like, come on. You guys remember those? They used to have, like, these little vintage babies. Um, yeah, really cute. And they had those faces. My home I love the little kitty. Come through with the bananas, like, come on. The yellow wave, though, I'm for it. I'm riding it. I want to know if you haven't patented that yellow, like, who makes it? Come on now. Who is it? Because it just don't make no sense. And you were able to use it on the canvas as well as on the glaze. Who makes this yellow? Come on, you're like, what? Okay, and honey can braid, too. Like, get out there. <laughs> Listen. The talent, though? Look at that traditional Japanese, like, blue and white. The little faces and the waves. Come on. There you go. Let's take me back to Mexico for a little bit. Because that Mexican F4 pottery, like, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> nah, but for real, though. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Look at that lucky face. Yes, you are lucky, baby. And so are you. Thanks for watching, baby.